let's go. There's an ST next to me. <laughs> Good morning, YouTube. Welcome to the channel. Hope you're having an awesome day. Uh, mine's brilliant. It's a super Sunday. It is. It's the day of the what? Azerbaijan Grand Prix. So uh, yeah, super Sunday. Um, and I'm here in the car, and I quickly want to make a video about something that's pretty important. And I just also want to say thanks. I want to say thank to thank you to each and every one of you that is subscribed to our channel. I'm sitting on a 201 subscribers. Holy smokes! I never thought I'd get to here, um, but yeah, I'm, I'm at 200 subscribers. Um, 17,000 views on YouTube. So that's pretty cool. And one of my videos is almost at 2,000 views. So pretty, pretty stoked about that. So thank you so much to each and every one of you for watching my videos, liking the content, and engaging. Um, Ahmed, Gary, Chartstack, Thank you so much guys, you've been, you've been stunning, you've been awesome, I, I really appreciate it. And I enjoy talking to you as well. So, um, and Epson, thanks buddy, really appreciate it man. Um, we're gonna see each other at the drag soon, <laughs> at a drag event, real soon. Okay, but I wanna say that. On top of that, I wanna give a shout out to my boy, Damien Beyond Cookie. I'm gonna put his handle up on the screen. Check him out, um, look, I. I like a lot of gaming channels. Um, I love PewDiePie, and Damien's channel is awesome. He's playing like the latest games, which is like dope. Um, he's got a he's got Fortnite. He's got Far Cry 5, and I enjoy the commentary, the gameplay. It's super real. He's playing 4K, full graphics. It's it's stunning. So so check out check out Beyond Cookie. So the reason why I'm making this video today is I have some terrible news. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty shocking. Um, it doesn't affect me, but affects about half of my audience up in the United States of America. So, um, this was for you guys. And um, I just want to say that I love the United States. I think it's the greatest country on earth. I support the Second Amendment. I, I would vote Republican. Guys, Ford is basically cutting five platforms far um, in the US. Um, this isn't my story, it's, uh, it broke on thefastcarlane.com. Um, I'll, uh, I'll add a link down below to the video so you can check it out. And they're gonna cut several platforms of cars that were made in the United States and in Mexico. So the first platform that they're gonna cut is the Fiesta. So this is within the next two years. Within the next two years, you won't be able to buy a Fiesta in the United States. Terrible. And I'm not taking, I'm not talking about certain versions of the Fiesta. It's like the Fiesta is going to die, which is sad. I think it's one of the funnest little small subcompact little hot hatches. Um, yeah, it's gonna die. So that's the first one. Then the second one is going to be the C-Max. Um, we've never gotten the C-Max here. So, yeah, we're not gonna, yeah, C-Max is gonna die as well. Sorry, the third car that's going to die um, is the Taurus. Now the Taurus is ancient. I'm gonna put in some fuel. I am back. What's up? <laughs> anyway, um, the Taurus. The Taurus, the third car that Ford is going to kill, is the Taurus. So, oh, nice, three quarters of a tank. Nice. Okay, um, wait, nitrate gate mean 50 kilometers? <laughs> but anyway, yeah, um, the Taurus is the one that's going to die. Um, the Taurus and the Fusion look similar. The Fusion is kind of like the new Mondeo, so. Yeah, I don't know what the Taurus is, but they do look similar. The Focus. Production of the Focus is going to stop. Sales of the Focus are going to stop as well. Now, that means this Gen Focus that you're driving, this Gen Focus ST, is going to be the last one. Um, <laughs> it's going to be the last one. 
shit. If you have one of these cars, don't sell it. Modify it. Drive it till it, the wheels fall off and then look for something else. If you haven't yet bought a Focus and you want to, start saving up seriously and, and get this. The only version of the Focus, the new Focus, is going to be the Focus Active, which is like a crossover kind of Focus. Going to be made in China, like they're moving the entire production line over to China. Um, and that's what you're going to get. You're going to buy the crossover Focus. There's not going to be an ST or an ST line or anything like that. It's just going to order. It's just strictly going to be that. I will tell you this. If you have the Ultimate Focus or Mark III Focus, which is the R8, in a couple of years it's going to sell for quite a bit. You know, um, Take that as a Fistrata 420 top tip. Don't sell that car now. Make sure you get the head gasket thing sorted. Make sure the car runs. And hopefully in a few years, you might drive the only and ultimate Focus. Um, like I said, the only car that you are gonna get is the Focus Active, the new Mark IV Focus Active, which is the ugliest of the range. Dude, you can pass through. Okay, then the other car is the Fusion. Um, now, the reason is sales have been dropping these cars and the biggest drop in sales has to be the fusion they dropped i think they dropped by more than 20 percent in the past year just in sales because they haven't done it it's a it's a comfortable car you can get ecoboost engine in it but it's a boring car not a lot of people like it not a lot of people buy it sales have been dropping and it's falling short in the segment um, against its rivals so the fusion is also going to go so within the next two years the fusion is not going to be sold in the united states of america what let me just oh my goodness i love the handling on this car okay so that's some bad news right there but there's some good news as well oh and i don't want to be the bearer of bad news but yeah the focus the fiesta the C-Max, the Taurus, and the Fusion are not going to be sold in America anymore. With the Focus, the exception only being the Focus Active. So, that sucks. But, you guys are going to get five new awesome cars. Going to be SUVs, probably going to be automatics because 96% of people in America buy automatic cars. Um, and you're going to get a whole interesting range of modified performance car, Ford performance car, which the rest of the world don't get. And that is pretty exciting. That's something to look forward to. And obviously the best truck in the world, the Ford Raptor. Yep. Um, I said it. Sorry, don't kill me. Um, they're going to invest a lot more into that as well. So I'm going to go watch cock blockers today. Oh, watch a John Cena movie because, well, I love American culture. <laughs> so if you do like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Share it with Ford fans and people who like Ford. And as always, please subscribe, guys. I really hope you guys subscribe to the channel. I'm going to keep making a ton more videos. So that's not going anywhere. And then obviously, stay tuned for more coming up on Vistrada 420. I am in the parking lot opening the wrong window and you guys should have an awesome day. Take care. Bye for now. Cheers.